Hey, 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 what's up, peeps? I'm back and I'm ready to have some fun. Let's do this, right? I hope you've all been doing well. Hope you didn't miss me too bad. I'm gonna be playing one of the old games I used to play back in PS1 days. It's called Soul of the Samurai. It's like Resident Evil meets shit, I don't know. Resident Evil meets something meets samurai hack and slash sort of. Shout out to my bro AJ, happy birthday bro, wishing you all the best, and to my friends out of the country, and to El Vaporo. So, let's get into this now, shall we? Grown men picking on a child. Here baby, I'll lend your hand. Whoever you are, I don't recall asking for your help. I'm... Whoops. Shouldn't have treated you like a child. Relax, I just don't like bullies. I'm not interested in kids. Lady, what did you do get the authorities on your tail? I'm sorry, but I don't have the time to chat. Well, neither do I. I have to hurry. Alright, maybe we'll run into each other again. Alright, for this playthrough I'll go with Ninja Lin. Chapter 1, Ninja. A ship laden with the Shogun's gold disappeared. A ninja, Shin, was dispatched to investigate when contact was lost with him. The Shogun had sent three more spies. Unbeknownst to them was the presence of a fourth ninja, Lin, Shin's younger sister. Yeah, this game is rel is pretty much short, like for the most part it's pretty short, so even if you combine po both playthroughs of Kotaro and Lin, it's like, like two hours max probably. Lin, that was careless of me, so much for my ninja training. I mean, but but to be fair, I, I would like to think that I know this game like the back of my hand, so... I guess because I know where to go that I can finish the game somewhat relatively quickly but I digress see that look at that mountain just look at that look at that beautiful pre-rendered background look at that man it's it's just so reminiscent of the old so reminiscent of the old days it's like wow Unfortunately, I have to talk to a bunch of NPCs to trigger the event that allows me to progress further because if I try to leave this area, I won't be able to. Okay, I should have talked to these NPCs in the beginning. Alright, now we know where the transport ship is. Alright, good. brother Shin. Now we have the tutorial which I'm gonna skip because no one cares about. I already know how to play the game and don't really need a tutorial. Alright, it's getting dark, let's call it a day. Alright Shin, let's go home. 
Yay. <laughs> All right, let's do this. I'm sure one of my buddies watching right now remembers this little tune. It's sort of an inside joke, only he'll understand. Daisy. Can't touch this. Why did you have to come? So this is where you hid, you shogunat dog. Hmm, another of your ninja friends. How convenient. All right, let's dance. I don't know how I did that, but... <laughs> Shit. Fight one-on-one, -on -one, you coward. There we go. Hang on, Hanzo. What happened? Our identities as ninjas were known to them from the start. I was attacked as soon as I arrived, but why? This fiefdom is behind the disappearance of the transport ship. Just as I thought. What are you doing with the gold? Genzo is, Genzo is investigating that. Ken is searching for Master. Genzo and Ken? Where are they now? I don't know. They should have their findings with them. And what about you, Hanzo? I'm searching for the sword, Rakuyo, that was loaded with the gold. I had my papers at our safe house. Go there. I will, Hanzo. Hang on. Lin. Master Shin. Shin? What happened to my brother? Hanzo? Hanzo, I promise I will avenge your death. Alright, let's just... Save our game. And onwards to chapter two. Treachery. Hanzo, a ninja sent after Shin, manages to brief Lin despite his grave injury. He directs her to seek out a safe house as his life ebbs away, but he succumbs before he could inform her of Shin. Lin is left to seek the others and her brother alone.
So where is Hanzo's safe house? Very, very close by, believe me. Hi honey, remember me? I'm Kotaro Hiba, we seem to run into each other. I'm Lin, I suppose we're both lucky to be alive, huh? <laughs> this isn't the time for this. Look, I'm sorry, but I have no time for idle chats, I'm going. Hey, wait, before you go. Honey, do you know anything about this? This is in code, and it's Genzo's writing. Who did you get this from? Is, is he still alive? Genzo must be dead. Why? What went wrong? No, he's dead. What does that say? I can't read it at all. Why do you want to know? You shouldn't get involved in this. Hey, look, I, I can't ignore this. If I had a kid sister, she'd be just like you. You, you have no right to say that. But I still owe you. Thanks for this. Thank you. Farewell. Arigato gozaimasu. I guess I have no choice but to check every house. Well, uh, lucky for you, Lin, I remember where the house is, so we don't have to look into every single nook and cranny. Alright, th this part always like just you know, creeped me out, and the part after this just used to freak me out to no end when I was a kid. I have to check every house. Temple, it says. Path of guiding of the path of guiding like reads. Hmm. Broken lamp, it says. Banner, it reads. Stone pavement says. Temple does, but I wonder what the rest means. I wonder how they fit together. Well, we will find out very soon. Yeah, this part used to just freak me out when I was a kid. Who's there? Kenzo? I heard you were dead. I'm so glad you're alright. Lin? Alright? Come see for yourself if this is alright. Boom. Yeah! You too can join me. Uh, yeah, I don't think so, pretty boy. Let's dance. Dude, fucking listen to that soundtrack, man. Sick. They don't make it like they. They don't make them like they. They, they used to, man. I swear. Uh huh. Mm. Shit. Not bad. Oh shit! <laughs> Knock the freaking basket off his head. God damn it. Onwards to chapter 3, Raven. Lin runs, aghast at the news of Genzo's death, as told by the Ronin she had met before. She is confronted by Genzo, who has been transformed. Having killed her former ally, Lin heads to the sea, taking a winding path through a forest of ravens.
All right, my sweeties, I will end this video here. Thank you so much for checking this channel out again. If you've watched this far, thank you so much. I appreciate your time. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay tuned and peace out, peeps.